All right, welcome to the stream. Thanks for tuning in. Uh, it's been a couple of days, I think, maybe one, but it feels weird not streaming extremely frequently during these holiday breaks, but... Oh, well. That's the only answer I have to that. One missed a day, I guess. All the days that streamed in a row for hours. Oh, well. Uh, 137 hours of Elden Ring in total. 0 0.1. 0 0.1 hours. 26.7 hours in the last two weeks. Right. Uh, don't know how long the stream's going to be today. I hope it's long enough that I can get things done. It says locals played 21.3 hours recently as well. Most people seem to sink a fair few hours into each time they boot it up. I can understand why. Got some weapons to upgrade, a boss to beat, and there's another cave nearby I can explore for bell bearings. See if that makes a difference. If not, just go on with Volcano Manor, most likely. Yeah, it seems like the next area. Has it loaded yet? I think it started. Yeah, there you go. Mouse controller, iPad. Where's the theme? See, so never had that piano to begin with. I don't remember it. I remember it having that string. What's it called? Crescendo. But I don't think it had that piano part. I'd be interested to know that they introduced the piano part just because. Um server maintenance when have they already done it May maybe they already have oh well I hope I'm online and we'd gotten back to the round table hold for me to buy a lot of Titanite to stick in some weapons before we go off and that's the max number of runes that I could spend since I'm all out I need to memorize this path also the boss the boss run so I haven't done the boss run in a while I've explored the rooftops but not the boss run. So you all need threes, which I don't have access to right now. Uh, and I actually don't have enough souls to upgrade anything right now. Because I spent them all. Okay. What am I going to do for the boss? Welcome Fex and Alan as well for some Elden Ring. I don't know what to do with the uh, abundance of Titanite shards. Hopefully you've both been well. Well enough to watch me uh, beat a weak foe, supposedly. I think that's about it, Fex. I think that's about it. And Alan's ready for Elden as well. Or from Elden. From Elden. Uh, gonna try. Gonna try. I think the greatsword was probably the best bet to do the most damage. But I'm gonna have to learn the boss run. Somebody's got a fix. I'll take that one. And this shield has better magic negation. Only by one. I think my biggest problem is going to be negating magic with these mages. 
and the heals that's increasing my stats but also the damage taken in anything or if anything stamina hp equip load yeah maybe for the boss i can change it up but until then raises my maximum fp not by a lot either i'm not gonna need this pardon me <clears throat> i'm not gonna need this brick i'm gonna need this great sword and i'm gonna need my small sword and i'm still medium you had a shake too that's my breakfast alan these days just about right still have Rogeria's rapier but I don't have like creatine or anything like that. Cider. I wouldn't mind a can of cider. I always forget that cider exists when there's <clears throat> beer and spirits. So there quite literally is nothing. So the next step is Ryu Lakari Academy. Right there. And Volcano Manor is next because it's right after it. Although there are a bunch of alternate areas <clears throat> pardon me so if my voice is a bit weird and a lot of cold milk straight away that's gonna be it can I have a mace equipped as well it'd be really helpful for that uh, large boss I can good good or a hangover box tomorrow that's if you get hungover today isn't it I am a human got the shield could I have a great shield no okay let's see what I can do that's been activated I forget where the boss run is I think the boss run is through those doors not the little door but the large door I'm gonna leave that virgin abductor there I'm not interested in her right now these guys can stay too. Problem is there are mages there. Fastest way to kill them is with this sword. He wants some. That's his ornamental sword that I saw. Almost one hit kill. Almost. Also magic. Lightning spear, magic fortification, shatter earth. Those cool come in handy. I don't think so. A full double breakfast. Talking sausages, eggs, hash browns, I'm guessing. <sighs> There's gonna be one guy right behind me firing. There are gonna be guys directly in front of me firing. I wonder if the best bet is to rush the guys up top first with something really strong. Most likely. Let's try it. And it's hanging like crazy. That was the right choice. But I missed time that attack. <clears throat> Which is fine. A tiny bit of health lost. I'll get it back. I'll get it back. So the boss run is rush these two. Sure. Because these guys are a distraction. And there's actually a mage down below as well. That one doesn't even aggro if I rush fast enough. Can I uh, jump attack you? Yes. So you're from inside. That's where you are. Good. Good boss run thus far. Got seven flasks. One that will negate some damage. And two magic fillers. In the meantime, I'll get the rest of my health back. And probably sneak attack this guy. He's not paying attention to me. 624. And now these two wake up. 
They're about as good as vermin enemy. Okay. Is the elevator next since the knight has been killed, the NPC knight? The one drop? It might be. I might need this magic shield as a damage negator, I might not. And see it's down there. It can stay down there. Will it go upstairs? That's what I'd like to know. Why don't we see how we fare against it this morning? I have flasks. I'm not going to use my heels in the first phase. Where did you go? Virgin abductor. There you are. Well, that would have been really helpful during the boss fight. Don't tell me I'm going to sneak attack you. Not really. Oh, he's going to be firing projectiles. That's going to be awful. Actually, not so bad. He's going to go in for a grab, isn't he? She? Nope. Pull back. And that's going to be open. Nope, swing time. Keep going. I like the destruction. That's going to open. Swing around. I still have my medallion on. Still. It comes through, as does that. Okay, it's one heal, it's fine. Probably two heals. It's just moving back and forth. Are you gonna grab me? No. Pull back. Spin? Yes. AoE. And you throw as well. And pull around you. Are you gonna open? Not yet. And pull around you. Are you gonna open? Spin. Well, that's a really helpful health boost. Open. No grab. Okay. Two heals. But I have two flasks. What I can do is get my FP back by killing these enemies with my sacrificial axe. That gives me a small amount of FP. I think each enemy gives you the same amount, so it doesn't matter. And that might be the ticket to fully, fully healing both bars with the boss. That black ball of magic will still stay there. How many crabs did you kill? Not all of them. Might be able to get it all back. Maybe. There are a lot of singular enemies like this here. Don't run away to the crab. Because there's a great big crab there. Yep, this is a great area to see the destruction of the abductor and to farm FP back from any losses. Only six calls across, what, nine hours local? Almost fully, almost fully healed back without having to use a flask. I don't know what the second phase of the boss is like. But I know what I have to do to beat her. That's not a problem. I think it's the second phase with all the magic projectiles that might be troublesome. Maybe I can stagger her. Maybe I can bleed her. She is just skin. 
Although my Uchi Katana isn't my most powerful weapon, does the Bloodhound Fang cause bleed up? Yes, it does. Yes, it does. Maybe Bloodhound Fang. My magic's full. FP's full. HP's full. Don't need this anymore. Good. With about half of a 10k split. And we need about 20k. Okay. Anything else has dropped? Seemingly not. He can stay there. Away to the boss is this way. The elevator through the um, shortcut with that knight over there. It is dead. Right? I don't think there's anything in this courtyard in terms of enemies. Memory. I'm surprised these guys will... Oh, there is a mage. Forgot about you. Pretty simple boss run. I wonder how Bloodhound Fang will work. I guess I have some... FP farming here. I guess, just in case. So maybe this is a really good spot to farm for their knives down there, their swords. Their weathered, ornate swords. What's well, not the weathered one, it's the ornate one. I hear noises. Of what? That side. Yeah, okay, that's the ball. Oh, and this is the teleporter we hadn't done. So you know what I'm... Oh, you could lure it out into the bridge, kill it by the bridge, have the ball fall on it. That's not a bad way of having the knight killed. There's also this shortcut. I think first things first, once we kill the boss, which is just past this elevator, we come back and we go to the uh, teleporter, which I'd forgotten about today. I remembered it yes, not yesterday, two days ago, but I'd forgotten about it. Is a Bloodhound Step an Ultra Greatsword, or is it just a Greatsword? I wonder if I can cause bleed on her, Bloodhound Step, I mean the Bloodhound Fang. No, it's just a curved greatsword. Okay, so if I get my curved greatsword. For blood. And I have my... Turtle shield. My health is full. I could have both. One to block magic attacks. I don't think I'm going to be able to block the magic attacks. They're going to do too much damage to me. It might be useless. So if I get rid of this, I'll be medium load. Have a straight sword for really quick attacks. Maybe even the Uchi Katana. No, this will do more damage. 181 plus 64. Hmm. It gives me the double hand bonus. 79. Because they're fleshy. This will swing faster, won't it? The Q wasn't higher than zero, which means you're waiting for calls. I'd say that's a pretty good day too. Pretty good day. I have the hatchet as well. The magic won't work. How fast is this swing? Probably not as fast as the katana. No. I'm gonna try the katana. It's a plus 10 already. 
180. This is 160, 180. It's only 20 points difference. Could I have them both just in case? I think I could have them both just in case. No. It worked last time, so I'm not going to mess with it. I didn't use this though. That's 300. How much is this? As well, 300. Except this has square off, but also bleed. I wonder. Now I'll keep this as my sidearm, and this is my regular. What's this moveset like again? Pretty big. Okay. 5,000 souls. I'm going to use the Balderkin's Blessing to get rid of that debuff before I walk in there. <clears throat> and then when we go second phase, I'm going to go ma Magic Negate. Although, I'll need a Talisman. Not a Talisman, I'll need a Staff. I wonder if that'll be too much to carry. One of these. 90 hours of all weapons farmed and all bosses killed. It's a good first playthrough. You can't have it. Could I swap one out for the other? No. I've got to pick. Or... Just try. For that second phase, she is magic, so I need magic negating armor. She's more this. She is pure magic, so magic negating armor. Stamina regen. I thought maybe an AOE spell. You have a heal just in case. Okay. I'm close to 90 hours with Queen of the Moon still alive. Close to 90? No. Uh, if you want the exact number, 126 or 8, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 4, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 12609 now. There you go. 12609 now. There you go. Summoning? I don't think so. Nothing. Okay. It's not going to give me the cutscene again, is it? I wonder if it will. Sorcerer ahead. Roughly two days. What did I want? I wanted Balderkin's blessing. Give me a poise. To temporarily boost poise. we go all right one shot do I need this one shot probably not that's gonna fall right on me yep I see you there two shot I see you there. That's health gone. Where's my amber medallion? Getting that health back for free. I see you doing something. Getting that health back for free. Like this. Okay, where are you next? Falling right there. Gotcha. You're right there. All right, down she comes. Blade? She's quite resistant to bleed. Dodge it. Almost got it first time. The books aren't so bad. Now we watch out. When she says that, she's gonna shoot me with heavy machinery. 
heavy machinery through bookshelves as well. So I need posts. And time to heal. I have seven flasks. It's gonna fall straight through those things. Yep. Almost kill me too. This is a heal moment. No flasks. This is the heal phase. Go one more heal. I don't have any more, but I have lightning spear. Where are you singing at? You're near me. There you are. I'll use the rest of my magic on you. Gone. That's both of you right there. No magic. That's a flask. She didn't fall already, did she? No way. Okay. That's phase two done. Why did she fall already? Was that a bug? Welcome in, Micah. I have to change medallions to my magic one immediately. Can't believe I don't like Dark Souls 1. You know what, just for that I'm going to turn this off and play it in the middle of the boss fight. In the middle of the boss fight. So Bloodhound Fang seems pretty good, I don't know what her magic is like. But if anything, we're going to take the teleporter back. And I don't even know if I should change medallions because I might just get one shot if I don't pay attention. Unless I can break her poise. Send word far and wide. Of the last queen of Caria, Granala of the full moon. And the majesty of the night she conjureth. The uh, cutscenes look really nice. What's this? A huge beam. It seems to stagger quite easily. Not good. Oh no. Okay. This is not the time to be stingy with heals. AoE, I see it. I see the AoE, give me magic negation. Oh, she has familiars. She has familiars. She's gonna shoot a giant set of projectiles at me. Sure, that's a punishable attack. That's very punishable. Punishing. Okay. Don't be stupid now. AoE. AoE. Dog. No, a sorcerer. A beast claw. Bloodhound stepper. A bloodhound stepper. And she's going to shoot me from distance. And huge. And that's the one I have to punish. What's she? AoE? Probably AoE. No. Oh, that's going to be like a spirit bomb or something. That, oh no. A dragon. That's not good. I need to kill her early. Move. That's fine. Damage negation. Kill. Don't kill. Three flasks. She's nearly dead. Let me go. Gotcha. <sighs> so we have another rune, Remembrance of the Full Moon Queen. I don't know about a 12 hour stream, Micah. I'll go for a little bit for sure. Elden Ring seems to do that for me. Sweetings, 
them out from whence ye hide. There are books and light aplenty, dither not. Come out, say I, or will ye be gravestones to be better born anew? I can't attack here, so she's a vital NPC. I'm not too bad, Micah. Kind of tired, to be honest. Haven't been sleeping amazingly, but, you know, what can you do? What about everybody else? Hopefully people are feeling all right. I don't know why it's harder. Oh, so this is a respec. She really re lets me respec if Tia. Ah, thou, is it thy wish no, I don't. To become a sweeting, reborn of my beloved egg. No, I don't want to respec. But you can rebirth and as well as change your cosmetics. Not at all. I'm good. Be not alarmed, nor afeared. I would birth thee as a sweeting, fair and fine. She does have an egg. But it's not moving. Saw it in the first cutscene, it didn't play again. Anything else to say? She an NPC on my map? Really? She's not? Maybe once I sit at the um race. And I'm not going to because I have the elevator to do behind me, and all those enemies should be dead. No. There's a chest there as well. Probably something really good. I hope. As a sweeting, fair and fine. It kind of looks like one, doesn't it? Or a wheelie shaped hunk of cheese. Well, two flasks and a magic. It's locked. This chest is locked which means I'm gonna have to get some <laughs> some markers some markers back what don't I need them on I need that there I need that there I guess I can stick one of these in the middle instead. And then say I have to come back for this chest. Because it's locked. A locked chest. Right there. Think she'll let me? If I ask, of course, bare feet. Very important in any From Soft Souls game. I don't have the right. I mean, you're right, I don't. It's locked. Let's note this side of Grace, not sit at it. Yeah, she wasn't too bad. Not with one flask. I used five. Not with one flask, unless just as part of a quest. Sure. Just, um, if you could keep that to something that I'd be like, hey, uh, why would I ever, ever have to come back here? Do you know what I mean? Because otherwise I'd just be like, okay, what's well, part of a quest? I'll forget about it. I still appreciate the help. Just, yeah, that would be helpful more. Big drama going on YouTube. What kind? Explain to me. I haven't been keeping up. So she's there now. Raya Lucaria Grand Library, Renala, Queen of the Full Moon. So she didn't die. We just uh, knocked her down a peg, I guess. But I know how hard it is to stop um, any kind of chiming in on Souls games, because I do it all the time too. Although I'm not bashing my head and going for the next five hours, I'm only going to stay here until I figure out how to open this chest. I think that's the difference. I can't crawl through it. 
Well, now since this is a boss arena, I can't attack, so I can't hit any fake illusory walls. I did hear a noise. Who is this? Political stuff? What kind? Is that the red haired guy? Radagon? Is that him? No crouching. I know the New Zealand Prime Minister, uh, she didn't retire, she resigned. I don't know why. She said she was like mentally drained or something. It wasn't amidst a scandal or anything. I think she was one of the most beloved political figures. Even Australians really liked her. Crowder pissed at Daily Wire. I don't know who the I don't know who Crowder is, but I know of the Daily Wire. I don't know they're if, like they're leaning though. They're left or right or independent. Which I guess would be left. And that's the way out. I suppose there's nothing else to do. But know that this chest here is part of a quest. I know tri tier. Just in case you didn't know. And I remember that was about the only thing I could take from this. That there was a chest here. There's no... I need a key, but I don't have any. I gave all mine away. And that's mine. The one, the other one I gave to the um, sorcerer. I have these. And the grapes for the blind girl. And these are my uh, respects. Larval tier. I'm guessing it's tier and not tear. And I'm still guessing that you can't go below the base stats. You start off with your own class as a knight. Picked a vagabond. Well, unless there are any um, corpses materializing in you, we're going to the teleporter and then we're, I believe, completely done with this area. Completely and utterly done with this area. Yeah, I did pick that up. Thanks, local. I'm guessing there will be. But, you know, I'm happy. Uh, until I beat the whole game, until I beat the whole game and I'm ready for New Game Plus, then I won't respec. I'll respec into something different. Or if I overlevel a stat without realizing it's soft cap or it's hard cap or whatever, like I had done in DS2, I'll do that. Yeah, I'm guessing that's about right. I'm fine with that. My stats are going to be high anyway because, you know, PvP is not a priority for my first time playthrough. Are there any other environmental details I can take a look at apart from these stacks and stacks of books? No ladders, I wonder. No. I wonder what the Sight of Grace is called. It's the Grand Library. I can't hit her. If I go to the round table hold, something will happen. There's still a door shortcut I haven't opened yet. She likes the moon. Not the sun or the tree, but the moon. Yeah, that makes sense. I mean, I'm all over the place. All over the place, which I'm fine with. We also got her, what, great rune, didn't we? There. Used to perfect rebirth. So this just lets me... Rebirth. Amber egg clutched by Renala, queen of the full moon, great rune of unborn demigods. Uh huh. So she's not a shard bearer, is she? She might be because she has a rune. Although it doesn't say that she's a shard bearer. Perfects those who have been. Oh. It perfects those who have been born in you. So once you do respect, this does something for you. Interesting. That's what I'm guessing from that. Children born in Ubar and Nala are all frail and short-lived. Imperfect beings, each and all. So there may be a potential drawback. Potential. Uh-huh. 
provides significant and this yeah it only occurs once that's right i think this might have been different in that it used to stay for a little while it just blocks the first hit significant damage and negation for the first hit did we even end up using it yes we did cool all right well I think we'd seen all the back of the bookcases and there doesn't seem to be anything else up front. No ladders, just a great big academy. Let's go on our way. I didn't see any other chests, but I didn't really spend a lot of time here either. The candles are a nice touch. Maybe they'll have something to say about me having a second rune. Still can't attack in this chamber at all. She's protected by the side of the round table's grace, I guess. Okay, it's a nice uh, boss arena. It is a nice boss arena. I liked it. Back down to the elevator, I guess. I wonder if there's anybody here for me. No? Did I travel too far that enemies are going to respawn anyway? I have two flasks to protect me. And my carrion knight shield. One hand that bloodhound fang. Down we go, I guess. Rani and Renala are, are, are connected. They're connected. Forty-five thousand souls from that fight. Hmm. Forty-five thousand souls. Interesting. Well, here we have it. The teleporter that I'm guessing from last stream had a message about this door. So there might be even more to this academy. Because here's a, 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 is it a transporter gate? It's not a called a teleporter, it's called ascending gate. I think that's what it's called. Where does it take me? Can I check by reading this message? We'll jump up, never mind. Yes. Far away location that I can't warp out of with 45,000 souls and two flasks. Oh. It, it teleports me here. Well, you know what? That's interesting, because I haven't been here at all. I see those papal hats. Oh, it's a, it's a turtle. I thought it was a rock. It's a giant turtle. I thought that was a big rock. It's just a large turtle. What do you have to say? People like the turtle. There's a chest there too. You are tarnished, aren't you? I welcome you to the Church of Vows. I am Miriel, steward of this sacred chamber. My apologies for the unseemly state of affairs. Do you know the origin of this place? No. How it came to be known as the Church of Vows? I don't know. Well, that is a shame. But who can blame you? You going to teach me? Shattering has caused us, all of us, to lose sight of something very. I think he's a little older than a teenager. At the Church of Vows, that the great houses of the Erd Tree and the Moon were joined by the matrimonial bond between red-haired Radican and Renala of the Fall. So they were married. And so our church holds in view the monuments of both houses. The Earth Tree of the Capitol and the Academy of Rea Lucaria. Thank you for that law. What else is your purpose? Oh, was there something you needed? Yes. You are free to show yourself around. I would serve as your guide, only my legs aren't what they used to be. Maybe he's a teenager. Anything of use, you are free to take it with you. 
Unless perhaps you are in search of instruction. It is true. In which case I will share all that I know. I would rather know those things about Radagon. Oh, you do sorceries and incantations? Interesting. You wish to know more of Lord Radagon. I do. Lord Radagon. Radagon. To these lands at the head of a great golden host when he met lady renala in battle he soon repented his territorial aggressions there and became husband to the carian queen however when godfrey first elden lord was hounded from the lands between radigan left renala to return to the earth tree capital becoming queen marica's second husband and king consort taking the title of second elden lord the mystery endures to this day as to why lord radigan would cast lady renala aside and moreover why a mere champion would be chosen for the seat of elden lord well i would think that's why he left her so he could become an elden lord you know it's said that lord radigan harbored a secret a famed sculptor of the Earth Tree capital was once summoned to render Lord Radigan's likeness in giant stature when he glimpsed the skeleton in Radigan's closet. And as such, it's said the great statue harbors his secret too. And that's all for Radigan, huh? You know, it's said that Lord Radigan harbored... Because it went to the bottom of that menu under Renala. When he glimpsed the and as such, it said so we need to find his statue to know his secret. What about Renala? To know more of Lady Renala. She is queen, head of the Carian royal family, Carian. and governor of the Academy of Rea Lucaria, the great and beautiful full moon witch. Sadly, her heart was broken when Lord Radigan left her, and then, when the Academy rebelled against the royals, she was locked away in the Grand Library. That was Rana. <laughs> Pardon me, Renala. Not Rani. In the end, Lady Renala was left alone, cradling the amber egg Lord Radigan bequeathed her. Now she devotes herself to it through forbidden rite, the grim art of reincarnation. You would do well to remember. Severing a vow, strongest of bonds, has consequences ever more dire. And that's all for her. You know, it's said that a famed when he glimpsed and as such. Uh, how are people dying here? Are they fighting this turtle? They might try to fight the turtle. I think they're fighting the turtle. Or an invader, but no, not this close to an NPC. Do you have a moon's tear for me? A tone? I don't need absolution. I haven't aggroed anyone. So this is the Church of Vows. And he is like, um, Earl of Karim. Oh, an Earl of Karim. Well, this, this thing here. To atone for sins. I think people are fighting him. Yeah, they are. Necessary item? A key? A gold sewing needle. Is this for Bok and golden tailoring tools? Let's check it out. Special sewing needle for demigod attire. Sewing needle made of gold. Unique item made to alter demigod attire. So boss armors. One of the tools brought by Radagon when he entered into marriage with Renala, Queen of the Full Moon, and joined the Carrion Line. Maybe we give this to her. I'm guessing not. This is probably for Bok. Tailoring tools made from gold. No, this is probably for Bok. Tools brought with the red haired Radagon when he married into the Carrion line. With these, even Demigod attire can be altered at, oh, at a side of grace. Or Bok does this, unless I give it to her. I'll show Bok first. Okay. 
I guess it's good that we can explore this area and mark it off our map now. I did see you there, didn't I? What was it that I had to show him? Something magic like. Is there something else? Celestial Jew. What can I study from you? Wow. I can buy these from you. Magic glint blade creates sigil that forms a projectile glint blade after a delay. An old sorcerer of the Karian royal family creates a sigil overhead from which an enemy seeking glint blade appears after a brief delay. That's what she used, I think. This sorcery can be used while in motion charging increases the delay said to be the prototype of the sword for Lanx sorceries wielded by royal enchanted knights. And this is 10,000. One of the sorcerers of the Karian royal family I can't use, but I can use this one. Conjures. Oh, sweeping slash using magical greatsword. Conjures a magic greatsword and then delivers a sweeping blow. So there's other battle mages use this. This sorcery can be cast repeatedly. Armed with the spell sorcerers gain the strength of knights, their loyalty sworn to the moon. And you also sell an incantation. One of the ancient Erdtree incantations grants blessing to self and nearby allies for 24 faith. Not quite there. Grants a blessing to the caster and nearby allies gradually restoring HP. Hold to continue praying and delay activation. Blessings once fell like tears from the earth tree, and this incantation is but a lingering remnant of their power. So you sell both sorceries and incantations. Celestial Jew. Where is my Celestial Jew? Celestial. I'm guessing it's a key item, but. Oh, here. Remnants. So, this is what we had gotten from the boss. And this is probably what's also a choice in the turtle. Remembrance of Renala. Take the parrot's namesake, but I think it here. Remembrance of Renala, Queen of the Full Moon, hewn into the Ur Tree. The power of its namesake can be unlocked by the finger reader. Alternatively, it can be used to gain, gain a great bounty of souls, of runes. In a youth, Ronaldo was a prominent champion who charmed the Academy of the Lunar Magic, becoming its master. She also led the Glintstone Knights and established the House of Caria as, the law, as royalty. Where's this celestial Jew? Oh, there. Carry out absolution at the Church of Vows, a hidden tier found in the internal city, also known as a night tier. Allows one to carry out an absolution at the Church of Vows, reversing all antagonizations. Once upon a time, the stars of the night sky guided fate. And this is a recollection of those times. Here, yeah. tell me about it. Oops, sorry. Talking to your foot. Do you possess any celestial dew? Yes. Then I would like to share my with you concerning the miracle of this church of vows radigan once cleansed himself with celestial dew repented his territorial aggressions and swore his love to Renal. and he did that with the jew of the earth tree and the fate of the moon were conjoined and all the wounds of war forgiven this miracle blesses the church to this day and so you need only follow Radigan's example to restore any bond, however strained or severed, to its rightful state of harmony. That must be due to uh, the covenants as well. Not just aggroing NPCs, but also covenants. It's said that a famed so you'll and a lead with that. You have another one. Let's talk to you about that. My faith does not waver. The miracle rooted in the grounds will once again mend the world he thinks so huh this time its bounty will not be squandered if you would be elden lord tarnished i hope that you too will share my faith i don't know what to tell you about that what about the miracle to experience the miracle kneel in the basin at the back and cleanse yourself with celestial dew. 
Absolution will be yours. Any bond, no matter how strained or even severed, will be put to rights. And that's it. To experience the absolution. <sighs> okay. Do we have anything to see here or pick up secrets and items? I wonder how much of these statues are actually unique to their locations and not just retreads. Never know unless you take the time. I like how the footsteps leave markings in the water. That's a really nice touch. And that's where I placed the tear. Chalice. Interesting. Church of Vows. They're always wrecked. Never intact. Do you have any items behind you? You don't have a tail cut, do you? Oh, I guess not. Oh, I guess not. I think that might be just it. Pardon me. People do try to kill this turtle, though, don't they? Don't they? Is there something else? Yeah, I guess I'll buy the incantations from you. <sighs> Didn't have anything to say about that. No. Is there something else? And nothing else? Is there something else? No, I guess not. Well, it's not like the dragon in DS1 as part of the covenant, which you can cut off its tail. That's it. Okay. He doesn't have anything on his shell either. Sure, if you kill him, he might drop his what bell bearing. I guess it's not about the size, but how he uses it, huh? <sighs> well, can be in a horse, finally. In a horse, on a horse, finally. And this is the area we had come from here. We hadn't fully exp um also the well. Yeah, we hadn't fully explored. This whole right side. Oh my. So much. They point me in two different ways. Well, there's the gator there. There's still this area here. I guess we can take that one off eventually. Explore. Cow? Or a goat? No, it was a goat. I've missed these goats. I've missed the bloodhound fang as well. Now, where does this go? To that little area there. And there is... Some kind of... Looked to be a bell, but I guess it wasn't. Okay, we'll go sit at the side of Grace first. I mean, you, you, might, you might be right, depending on the um, school of thought there, local. What's the site called? Church of Vows, that makes sense to me. Turtle ahead? Liar ahead. Omega male, we're not even talking about Sigma males anymore, but Omega males? Where are the skeletons coming out of the ground? In this area. People luring the turtle out this far even? Or oh, there's an invasion. Well, there's another Berserk Memorial. Let's have a read. Surprised it teleported me here, but I like that. The Second Leonian War. No victory for the Golden, nor for the Moon. No prize but atonement, the birth of a vow. So they don't win anything. 
they just had the option to atone. Okay. And this was where... Oh, let's see. I had gone past the wolves, I think, or the, the two bears. Down that side. Oh, yeah, and that too. Oh, yeah, I remember this. I do remember this. We finally have a day-night. Because we're out of the dungeon. And that's the jump across. I think I remember these guys. Who are you calling? The... The chariot? It'd be cool if the chariot came just because of that. Oh, there are more of them? Okay. Is there anything around the other side, maybe? It's Church of Vows. Guessing probably not. My mom. My mom is on the other side of the Church of Vows. Hi, mom. Why people are dying here? Invasions? Bell bearing night? Maybe not. What was a vantage point? Cemetery? A lot of these churches have cemeteries behind them, don't they? And is that Raya Lucari Academy? It is. Must have an item here too. Stormhawk feather. Sure. It's nice to see it. Oh, that dude was calling my mom. Mom! Mom, you better hurry up. You're being summoned. Something up there. That's the academy bridge that's broken. We take the gate all the way across to. We still haven't explored this side or this side. Not yet. Walked right into that one, didn't I, local? Right into that one. True, mist is now here. Good pick up. Triple H, you like Triple H? I prefer Shawn Michaels. H H H or H B K. I'll go H B K. Oh, just mushrooms. Likely mist. That's true. That's so true. Triple H says Fex over HBK. Really? That's interesting. I like the pedigree. I think the pedigree is a great move. It looks devastating. Because your hands are hooked. You can't you can't protect yourself. Until the very, very end. But if for whatever reason he held them the whole way through, you're in a lot of trouble. Double underhook face buster. What a great name for a move. The pedigree. That was carried over from his uh, blue blood days, wasn't it? Kept it all the way there. Triple H and William Regal, what a team. I didn't see any items, I guess. Oh, but he, he tunes up the band fix in the corner. That's not a bad way, actually. Because you have the super kick from nowhere, like the RK or the diamond cutter, and then you have the, the signaled finisher, the long drawn out finisher. People are dying here. Okay. Interesting. I think he was a better wrestler. Oh, that's why. Well, you know what? I have something for that. Yeah, see? I have something for that. The one miracle I'm gonna use. I don't have that. Oh, I, oh, I see. Hold on. Your, um... 
You're serious. I see. Not good. Okay. Don't want to die here. I see you're serious. Never mind. That's my last. That's not good at all. It needs a mace. That's why people are dying here. I'm going to need a mace real quick. What are you doing? Uh, there we go. That'll be at least something. It's good enough. Okay. And you're not dead until I do this. Are you? No. Yeah, I really underestimated you, didn't I? You're gonna proc bleed on me? Okay. Does that mean they only come out at night? But I get some back. Enough for a heal, huh? Maybe I just needed to trigger them. But yeah, they're no joke. Especially with such few flasks and no blunt weapon for skeletons. Skeletons hate blunt weapons. Pardon me. Okay. Are there any other skeletons that I could have missed? You know you have a really big skeleton problem here, don't you? Giant turtle. Yes, this is the, the skill check before you're able to enter the Church of Vows. No wonder there are stains here. Okay. Did you ever tell me who your favorite was? Wrestler? Hmm. Wrestler was Fex. Was it Bret Hart? Dynamite Kid. He was Canadian too, right? No, he was British. But I think he did a lot for Stampede Wrestling. Tom Billingsley. Oh, likely mist is that. Yeah, that, no, that is a misty place. It's a very misty place. Did you ever tell me what your uh, favorite wrestler was, Bex? Who your favorite wrestler was? Was it Bret Hart? Do we have that in common? Parcel ahead. It's all good. Yeah, imagine getting teleported here, but yeah, sure. Gotta have the hitman. I watched Ow a clip of Owens from Twitter recently. I don't know if I talked about it, but I, th I think he was underrated. He was working against Bam Bam Bigelow, and uh, he was incredible. Owen was just, he had size, he had speed, he had agility, uh, strength, technique. I think he was bigger than Brett. I think, size-wise, can't believe they did him like that. I can't believe they did him like that. The blue blazer gimmick. And then what do they do? Continue on with the pay-per-view. Man just dives live on television. And they continue. It's, tr it's tragic. It's tragic. Yeah, was he meant to be like a, a gimmicky superhero? Like that was the joke that, haha, ha, he's a funny, thinks he's a superhero. He's a funny guy, he's a goofy character. Is he's a superhero? Is that the deal? See, I couldn't, I didn't see that part of his career. All I know is WWF Attitude had the rip owen memorial to start of the game and i was like i don't know who this guy is i think he was in that game actually that might have been his last game didn't miss anything there i know he was with coco beware and high energy it's a tag team in the mid 90s when what brett had pulled off as a single star no that had happened the very early 90s 
I think. Oh, the mid 90s when Brett was getting his push. He was Intercontinental Champion. I watched that match with um, Rowdy Roddy Piper. I think it was WrestleMania. Re WrestleMania, I don't know what. I don't know what WrestleMania it was. Uh, three? Is it really WrestleMania three? 19, no, it couldn't have been. Five or six? Five or six? Early 90s. Intercontinental match. Piper drops the belt to Brett. Or Piper had gotten the belt from Brett and Brett wanted the belt back. And Piper hadn't been pinned on TV in like a year or something. Or he had never been pinned clean or even pinned at all from memory. I don't know what to think about that. I didn't know Roddy Papp was such a big deal. Turns out, yeah, he was. Indeed, he was. I don't think I'm going to see anything else here. Did not know that about Roddy Piper. Nice quick 12-minute match or so. Less because of the introdu introductions and everything. Probably like a 7-minute match, all in all. Or thereabouts. Told a really good story really quickly. Can't fault matches for that. So I guess we have the side to do because there's nothing else around here. Okay. And there's a little pack of enemies that might lead me to something. Maybe. Then I watched Brett and Davia in your house. That was a really good one. That was a really good one. With Diana. She's not a very good actress. But she's not supposed to be, I guess. Good angle there. With Brett. The sister-in-law now. Hooking up with... The ex-champ. Who wanted the belt back. Or who Brett had lost the belt to in SummerSlam of that year at Wembley, and they had the In Your House pay-per-view. Can I get it? Not like this. There we go. So much wrestling, so many video games, and there's an item there too. So many things to do, and so little time to do it. So little time to do it. <sighs> That's very true. What are you playing? I saw Seven Days to Die on Discord. So I'm assuming still that. With, uh... I was gonna say base, but it's not base, it's mace. I get a vantage point here. For an item in a chair, it's likely. Never mind. Really like that game. And your son, look at that. There's a trio of troublemakers. Speaking of trouble, there's a lit skull, a lit human skull with the runes in it. That's a good sign. I guess they use these to mark you. They go, hey, go here. There might be something here. That's what these skulls are for. As opposed to this rock outcropping with Mr. Head. Fire ahead, try jumping. Don't, don't jump. Don't jump there at all. Not at all. Crystal Bud. I hear, well, there's the moon. Thought I heard running water. Interesting. A lot of sunflowers here because they're so close to the Erd tree. Probably. It's a really big world. It's a huge world. It's massive in size. It really is. It's massive.
Can I get him with a spear? Where'd you go? Too far. I can't talisman on my uh, horse, no. That would be too much. Okay. Well, there's still that ammo item over there and still this part of the plane to explore. You bet there is. I've got about a level of souls and then some left over for upgrades. No Titanite consumable purchases, just upgrades. That's a path we haven't been down. What are they doing down there? Are those giants? Uh, I don't think I've seen those creatures before. So they might be brand new encounters. Brand new encounters. Okay. Brand new encounters. I heard that. Well, there's another cemetery, and of course, a cemetery is going to have skeletons. I need a mace. I need a mace. Can you hear that in the distance? What is that? Oh, it's another turtle. Wow, okay. Very interesting. Very interesting. Actual snipers and a turtle. I can't enter my map. But yeah, they're guarding that grace. There's a jump there, I see it, but probably for later. Turtle in that big passage over there. We'll have to get there eventually. Did I get my mace? I did. Let's hope we can go with these skir skirtles? Skeletons. People try to jump down there and die, huh? They're gonna be the big Grim Reapers, most likely. Didn't clang its bell. I just hear its footsteps. Champion. I think these rocks are for views. Yep, for vantage points. Another turtle. I didn't expect to see one. There's another turtle there too. Look at that. Right there. So two turtles right next to each other. Hmm. That means we have to beat more main bosses or else we get a complete waste messages are going to warn me about skeletons aren't they oh of course probably this one see how much easier it is oh with the mace Just a mace. That's the only difference. These skeletons, blunt damage. Still alive. And you resurrected, didn't you? If it was a holy mace, it would kill them in one go, I think. Stop them from resurrecting. A grey violet. I get some heals. Does healing, holding heal do more? I've always wondered that, because I hold it all the time. Hold to continue praying, no. It's just heal. And there is more ur trees. Whoops, just fell. Good to know. Good to know. I think that's it for this area. Shame we just get the, um... not going to charge now. Wonderful. 
already been an hour and a half. Can I hold? Stay steady. That'd have been really nice if it could do that for me. I guess that's good enough. Okay. But I think that's it for this area. Just a path down. Path down to turtles. We hadn't gone that way either. We hadn't gone that way either. Sneeze, pardon me if I do. Mm, my eyeballs. Ow. I guess that's it. Pardon me. I still that locked during the academy, but I think it has something to do with the chest. Something to do with the chest. Thanks, Vex. Now see these runes, that means we get more runes. At least these third leaves means we get more runes from killing enemies. Looks like we've killed all the enemies in this area. We get that. Here. Is that one? Not regular. Okay. So I guess the next area we can go to is, well, the Volcano Manor. Because, uh, well, we could also go here. Past the arches. That's where these two sites of grace are pointing me to. See, they're all leading in a path. Academy, academy, and then go right across, go right across, and this, go right across there. But the giant says I shouldn't go there. Maybe he means I go around through the gate instead. Maybe. I could drop down. Although it's very dangerous. <gasps> Ooh, see, I must fell. Because the horse. I do wonder what my next stop will be. The path of the tarnished, perhaps local? You know what I think I'm gonna do? I think I'm gonna hit that turtle. No oh, you almost knocked me off the edge, didn't you? I'm gonna hit that turtle that I had left. My arrow sticking straight out of my chest. Unless I take the path the giant told me not to, but he told me not to. And I listen. A good, good tarnished. Anyway, I do need to sit down and go upgrade things with the souls that I have. I know they're runes. But also we have enough. The turtle? You think I'm going to kill the turtle? I would never kill a Dark Souls NPC. I don't think I've ever killed a friendly Dark Souls NPC. Ever. Never, ever, ever. Let there be armament? Really? Interesting. I don't know if that's true. Maybe as in the sides from... I want to hit that ass, Hit the turtle's ass. Never. Unless that had a tail cut weapon. I would never dream of it. I don't need this magic negation on at all. What I wouldn't mind is... This one. I wouldn't mind that one. Definitely don't want to clap turtle cheeks. A little too young for me. I need at least 40,000, 50,000 years. That could be a path. There is a side of grace there anyway. Right across from there. Pardon me. We have some side dungeons to do. We have this whole academy to do. What is that down there? Oh, it's them. They died. Mysterious courses. Mysterious courses under mysterious circumstances. 
All right, well, I guess no skeletons are going to be here, so we'll track back. I feel like those golden rune skulls are really for pathfinding. Are really for showing you, hey, um, there's stuff here that's worthwhile checking out. Pardon me. Like this, look at this. Oh, I thought it was a person. One of those shadowy ghosts. It wasn't. It wasn't at all. Let's go see if that turtle... No worries, get some sleep. And enjoy your dinner too, Fex. Sleep and dinner, I wouldn't say no. Although it's only 12.48pm. So you've got all those fire slugs there, huh? Yeah. All of those fire slugs. And there's that area there, too. Are you weak to any of this? Not really. Ow. He just killed my horse. How dare you? Oh. I'm getting hurt. I'm getting hit because it's so hot. I ran right into its spikes. <laughs> right into its spikes. See, there you go. This, this man right here. He needs to go. There we go. What if he drops that head? The mask of that thing. What are these? They're not quite hollows, are they? They're not quite hollows. Frost is probably best against you. Or two swipes is enough, and you'll always drop a smoldering. One heavy, uncharged. Yes. Rosanen. The order, sleep first, then eat, eat, then sleep, same time, do them both. We don't need that encampment, we've done it. I'll take the butterflies that hang around the flames, the torches, I think, or something of the flame-related, uh, I want to say improvements, like resin. Look at all these goats. All these thin beast bones. So many of them. It's like a really good area to farm them. It's a really good area to farm them. There's so many. So many. It's good you can grab items on your horse. Could you imagine if you couldn't? Do you think they ever had that? A point in development where you couldn't grab items on your horse, you had to get off, and they just were like, no. We're not Red Dead Redemption. We don't need you to have a 45 minute cutscene of you um, pulling out the beast bones from the animal that you've just slain. Slain or slayed? Probably slayed. Like the band. Let me run around this thing. Did we go around here? I I honestly don't I don't think so. No, because there's the turtle. We might have. But I I don't think so. Might have just stopped short. Because of that edge. Oh, I almost fell off. I almost fell off. Horse, please. Absolutely no life ahead. See those eagles? See you too. You can't run off the edge. You're scripted not to. I'm, I'm missing every one of my swings. You're going to lure me into dying, aren't you? You're going to lure me into falling off an edge, jumping off with my horse, and that'd be it. Trouble. Do we leave anything else behind with these slain beasts? Yeah, I believe these are just to show you paths. They're pretty good at it too. Plus you actually have, you know, an actual path. Uh, I don't think so. Never checked, never tried. Don't think so. Disagree. It's a no from me, dog. Sound off in the comments, guys. Set up a poll.
Okay. We're done with that area unless we want to go further, which I don't. Which I don't. And uh, apart from you, I want to go upgrade my level, which is under 20k, and then the rest are going into weapons. We need the round table for that. Look at all these corpses. All of these corpses. So many. Pyromancers? I mean, we have six. Really? Yeah, I knew that wasn't going to be good to stand in front of. I knew that wasn't going to be good to stand in front of. He got no poise, that's why you break so easy. That's why you break so easy. Is that a counter hit? Because you were charging an attack? I reckon that should have been. But I held that for a little bit longer and it felt like I didn't get any damage. That's death from everybody, huh? I think it is a great mechanic that if you clear out a camp, you get, um... Again, I don't need to hold that. You get flasks. It lets you just play longer and longer and longer without having to um, rest at a side of grace, which is great. I think it's a great mechanic. Your wife thinks she's funny? What's the funniest thing she's said or done? Was that her comment? Did she, did she type the above? <laughs> Before that? Because I'm not going to lie, that was pretty funny. Dare I say, hilarious? How dare she tarnish your name like that, Micah? I like all of these butterflies. Can't believe she got your phone. Hide all your wrestling pictures. All your wrestling pictures. Especially the Trish Stratus ones. So, uh, we have two paths. That whole part, which we've done, and then uh, the study hall entrance. I wouldn't mind doing the study hall entrance. It seems like a nice, small, self-contained area instead of having to clear out these huge, giant spots. That seems much more feasible to me. Much more feasible to me. So that was her, unless you're trying to carefully, craftily, throw her under the bus. A big smelly bus, I guess. A great big smelly bus. Speaking of great big things. Hello. Yes. I am not going to buy any more of these from you. I'm going to ask you to strengthen my weaponry. Thanks to the appraisal. Everybody knows that's true. Everybody knows that's true. No more upgrades? I have this. And this. Cool. Ooh, plus six. Now that's something I don't have a lot of, right? Because my Uchi... I only have ones and twos purchasable. Yeah. So I'm going to leave that. Just ones and twos purchasable. I believe this is a regular item. And I'm going to hold off on the threes. Just hold off on the threes. Do we need more for axes? Looks like not. Okay. Uh, I'll use twos. Twos are fine. But I'm holding off on threes. Which I've said maybe three or four times. It's a really great giant sword. Don't know if it's any good, but it's it's great. And only this, plus three. Right, two. Okay. And plus one smithing stone, sure. You only get two long swords per playthrough. Am I going to get every sword and shield? 
Look, I'm going to try before I do New Game Plus, yeah. Um, or what I'll do is I'll... I'll explore everything I possibly can, and then the new game plus runs will be, you know, getting things. I don't want to. I don't want to spend hours and hours grinding on enemies because there are probably lots of things I would like eventually to have all of the items. It's probably incredibly difficult because there are so many more than in, in Dark Souls One. I need to upgrade this longsword as well because they have two different. Um, Weapon arts, although local is telling me that sword with a 0.5% drop, not great. I'm going to need my item discovery. I wonder what my item discovery is, is even at. So they drop short swords. I know these are droppable. These aren't. I don't think you can even buy these apart from one. So you know what? It's plus six. Would I need anything else? Plus six, my big hammer. Plus six. My flail. My flail is plus six. The war pick could be cool. This need this is already seven. Who is the dude that streams with the chick I raid? Darth? Darth Quietus? He knows fan. Or do you mean um Hawk butt, flying hawk butt? I think we raided Hawk twice. She's Australian, so she's usually on late. As in late for me, which is like seven, eight o'clock. Is that who you mean? You'll have to let me know by name because I've just given you two. And if you say yes, then I won't know which one's which. I guess we can upgrade this large club. Was a guy and girl? Uh, talking together? Uh... Oh, Dr. Beer. Oh, Dr. Beer. Yeah, Dr. Beer. That's Dr. Beer. It's just a regular club. Dr. Beer. Yeah, right. Yeah, they do, like, uh, talk shows and stuff. You check out some of his material. This is interesting. Spiked Club. He's into music, I know. So this is the Flail. Regular large club. Cold Spear is plus three. Halbert is also plus three. He does a lot of souls. A lot of soul stuff. Some things don't plus three for that. See, Lucerne's already got C and Dex. The Lucerne already has a C and Dex. Already. At base level. So that needs to be made keen. Sure. I have a lance too. I really don't have a lot of range. Just stopped in for a minute. Fair enough. I really don't have a lot of range. So I'm gonna go with the ice spear. Yeah, I really have very little range. Um, this already has one on it. Wouldn't mind giving some to the Lucerne. It's not a bad weapon. And I'm going to run out of level one, uh, level twos before I run out of level ones. So the lance is already plus one. And this, this gives blood loss. But there was one that also has, and this one also has fire, but it takes somber smithing stones. Damn, somber smithing stones. And a large club has one. Before though. Because it's a large weapon, it takes more? Maybe. It might. And those are all my smithing stones. Okay. And I'm actually... have spent enough souls that my weaponry means I can't level up. Look, broadsword has a C in strength. That needs to be made into a strength weapon. Still don't know about and the Lucerne as well to a quality weapon. So upgrading does help. Uh, unless I spend all my... I could do that. I really don't need the levels. I could spend them on weapon upgrades so I can try some different weaponry. Out. 
Is he still telling me not to um move in? Are you liking Dr. Beer stuff? I wanted to do um a DS2 co-op run with him, but it's hard because of the time schedules. So he tells me to stay away. What happens if I don't? He won't be mad at me. But it, it won't be good. Um, does Selen have anything else to teach me? He won't tell me anything new. She's down there. Right down there. Still here, Selen? Selene? Shall we commence the lesson? I believe I've bought everything I can from you. Yeah. Does me beating that last boss mean that no longer... Wait, what if I go to Bok? Who is... Well, um... After the church, the castle. Yeah. Yeah. He won't be mad, he'll be disappointed. Who will be? Oh, the giant. Yeah, maybe. It doesn't seem like there's too much dynamic NPC interactions in terms of... What if I had opened that chest without the turtle's permission? So does this let me... No. Oh. It just lets me make altered... No, it doesn't. This is just what I have on right now. Okay, never mind. So yes. Please do be safe on your journeys. Okay. Let's go talk to um, Renala because I have that. Um, that's done. Because I have. Something is there, a fountain. Because I have a needle. Golden threaded needle. Scarlet rot. Oh, it's behind her. Thou, Do you care? Thou now sure? No, you don't care. Be not alarmed. I would birth thee as... Okay. And it's still locked. Okay. <sighs> Three hours to the end of the shift. Sounds like something I would say. Playing Dark Souls. Seven, which is Elden Ring one. Where's that needle? Here it is. Demigod attire. I guess I don't have any demigod attire. The wait time is more than five minutes for a call to come through the queue. I'm guessing. Okay, let's go round table hold and see if the cleric is still there since we had beaten a boss. Oh, that's right. I wanted the turtle to see if cleric's gone. No. Oh. To be doing well. I only get longer from now on. Well, then. Would Just dodge calls. Look, I won't tell anybody. I've been waiting for assistance from that company for 35 years, but don't worry, I won't tell anybody. There's nothing here. Okay. May the golden order sure. Nobody come back. Nobody has come back. Let's look at Renala's. Well, no, first we'll go grab it from the turtle. And uh, I'll buy, that's what I was going to do. I'm going to make the broadsword a strong broadsword because it has better scaling and strength. An ash of war. Look at that, C scaling on strength. So it is a strength. Don't feel like talking anymore. You're just tired, you tuck it out. You've done a lot. You've done a lot. Um. It's worse by about 20 points and it goes to B. <laughs> uh, but it, it goes up by 10. It goes down by 17. Do you know what I mean? Like... Uh, undo the enhancement. What does it normally have? Square off. And I, I literally can't have it. Not have an Ash of War. 
So these are all the strength ones, right? Yeah. And then you can pick, though. These are the strength ones. But you can pick. I could two-hand it for more damage, I guess. It's crazy to me. B scaling, and it's worse. Yeah, 17 points, C. Down to 50... Uh, from 57 down to 40. And I only get 11 points. Because my stats are so, you know, over the place. Your phone's browser keeps going to bad pages. What do you do? Throw your phone out the window, I'm going to guess. It's your phone's fault. It still has a C in strength. The damage falls. And then you can do anything for these. But these seem like quality. Stormblade, Stormcaller, and Determination. Hmm. I did want to fire a uh, broadsword, a longsword for DS1. As a reference. And then I don't know if we get, po we might get poison later on. Sacred short sword, a keen short sword. Dua. That's a, a C and a C. A keen. Oh, it's because it's. So these are heavy, these are keen. That's he keen by nature. Don't know what these are. That's quality by nature. That's magic by nature. Oh, I see. That's five. Oh, I see. Okay, it keeps whatever the default is. Would I would either sleep with a 14-year-old or a cat? No other option available. Well, a 14-year-old would send me to prison. A cat would send me to maybe Peter. Pick your poison. I don't have kick. So these are heavy. Look at that. They drop down. War cry. Break the guard with a broadsword. I feel like a long sword would probably be quality. And these are keen by nature. That's keen. And these are quality, I see. Right. All right, well, we'll give it kick, I guess. A heavy broadsword with kick. And I just... I can't make it heavy unless I give it kick. Square off. Do I have square off on anything else? Yeah. Most straights. And my heavy sword. All right. Kick. Heavy. There. Heavy broadsword. What's worse, I mean, a cat will probably mangle your penis. A 14-year-old will mangle your life. Not to mention the 14-year-old's life. But also the cat will be pretty bad off too. No, there's no other option available. You just can't, you know, self-terminate. Or just not. Just You, you can't just not do that. I've got level four smithing stones for this sword. <laughs> oh. Which one is it gonna be? Oh, you keep finding edgy videos and memes on your phone? It has a mind of its own. It must. They do do that. The kid or the cat. If I have to pick it, it'd be the cat. That seems like the only option that would be at all somewhat appropriate. So a longsword will go to D, Dex. Is willing to let me do her? And I don't know if I want to do that either. They both sound like terrible options. 
129, 62, 129, 55, 118, 71. Okay. I guess it is these, isn't it? Stormcaller Swords, Storm Blade, Storm Stomp. But a heavy broadsword. That's quite a uh, question. Bestiality or pedo? It's gonna be raw. Why do I have? Why do I have to think about these sorts of things at 1:13 in the afternoon? Why do I have to think about those sorts of things at 1:13 in the afternoon? Explain that to me. Explain that to me. I feel like that's a. I don't know. Undo. It's standard right now. What would I have to think about that? It would. It would shred my penis, and and I would have to be okay with that. So these are quality. I suppose a longsword is more quality than keen. It's both. She won't. Oh, oh, that's even worse. The idea that it won't protest makes it sound so human. Makes it sound so terribly, awfully human. So these are naturally scaling for quality. Oh, that's just awful. Just awful. All right, a quality longsword. I'll go another quality longsword. I wonder what this is on. Oh, keen short sword? That's interesting. A quality. Okay. And that's the strength. The rest of the lord swords. You know what? Why don't we give that th something? Because this is not going to be it. This will give me B strength. Does that mean it's a better B weapon? B, sorry, dex? I feel like a qual a short sword, a long sword is quality. Local writes in the chat, and this is him writing in the chat, by the way. Child pussy or pussy pussy? <sighs> I think I need a glass of water after that one. I um, think I definitely, definitely need a glass of water after that one. Okay, let me give it determination, I guess. Just quality. And now I have these two as my storms, storm swords. This has better s s um, deck scaling, right? C to D. B to D. Yeah, it's much better decks. The short swords are much better decks. Weapons. Much better. They have kicks by nature. Yeah, I think everywhere we would choose the cat. I think you would ha you would have to choose the cat, which is saying something. Which is saying something. Okay, let's put our dex weapons on here then. I guess. Spitting Slash. Impaling Thrust. Repeating Thrust. I'm going to have three of them. One, two, three. The Sword Dance. Keen. 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 And then I could have one more Short Sword. What would be better, sword dance or repeating impaling thrust? What's sword dance? I'll leave quick step for something else. Yeah, uh, that's something to walk right into, isn't it, Fex? On a day like today, ugh, that's something to walk right into on a day like today. Flurry of thrusts. Oh, this has, um... Storm Stomp, that's why. No, I don't want this to have Storm Stomp. 
Impaling thrust. Piercing an enemy's guard. Longsword looks nice. Okay. Yes. Um, this is the one. Storm Stomp. You don't want Storm Stomp. I want you to have Spinning Slash. Keen. Yeah. And then I need another short sword. I wonder who will drop them. Quick step for these daggers. Weathered straight sword and the Lord Sworn as well. Upward cut. Lion's claw. Upward cut. I mean, is this going to be quality now or what? <sighs> Fortunately. Or arcane. For bloody slash. Although I lose a fair bit, I get an art. I get a B in strength and no dex. No, I don't think that I lose 20. I mean, you can change the affinities. But it feels like these are the strength ones. By nature, see, it gives me a B. That's a B. That's a C. I feel like a great sword would be strength. Strength attribute is higher than its dex attribute. These are equal, so that's quality. This is, well, that should be quality because it's both 10. But it went to C naturally. Interesting. Broadsword has the same stats as a longsword. 10, 10, 10, 10. Although better scaling. C. He wouldn't answer. He's a smart man. And this has more decks, hence it's keen. Okay. Time to upgrade weapons. With 15,000. Because I'm all out of souls. And I think Fix is all out of answers for that question. But if you had to, Fix, you know, if you, if you had to... If you, if you really, really had to, what haven't I worn in a long time? I haven't worn this in a long time. Although I never wear the... I like wearing full sets. I don't really like mix... I haven't worn the chain. Let's wear the chain mail. I haven't worn the chain mail in ages. In ages. In forever. Uh, what was the chain mail sheet? Wasn't the was it the heater shield? Could have been Harry. Probably not. Use the skill for the sword. Or one of these. No, I I don't think anyone. <laughs> that's this. That's the scenario. Fix. That's the scenario. You have to pick one. I think this one works best because it's silver and lee and metallic. I think so. This was the one we started with. Which looks cool too. But I think for the chain mail goes silvery and metallic. I also use a large leather shield. That's not so bad. Chain mail. Goes silvery and metallic. I also have these disgusting shields. This one doesn't look very nice to me. It all looks so chipped and broken. Kind of like the chain mail. Look, it's totally busted. You know? Shield of honor depicting a city crowned by the sun. It has seen better days. Much like the wear upon the shield, the seed the sun has long faded away. Okay. I can't imagine doing either of those things. I'm being completely honest with you. And yet here I am, being completely honest with you. I've got zero of these. 20, well, there it is, 20. Five, and five, one. And those are all my runes gone. Apart from the ones I picked up, which I'm gonna use now. Which I'm gonna use now. Where are they? There. I have 17 of the teeny tiny ones. Alright. Here we go. 
Let's start using something different. You know what I'm going to use? Not this. Something completely different. I'm going to use the frost spear, the cold short spear, and this shield. That's what I'm going to use. Uh, stats, damage be damned. Watch me pay for it. Uh, what would be good? Counter attacks. Yeah, thrusting weapons. Spears. This one. That's what I'm going to use. And I'm going to go with... Can I have one that boosts my... Stamina reducing attacks against blockers? No. Force back, jump attack? No. More health? No. Roars? Spears kind of slow. Huh. Damage taken. Let's go stamina recovery speed. All right, we're gonna use the cold spear and our chain mail. Oops, sorry, and our chain mail. So we have three k. We can still upgrade. I'm not sitting next to you, lady. You're gonna debuff me. What else can I strengthen? I'm not strengthening that. Uh, some of my short swords, or even the quality long swords. Better go to plus six. Yep. With those ashes of war. Cool. Uh, we hadn't done any of these actually. Damn. Poor short sword. Have we done anything else we haven't touched? Apart from, you know, the regulars? None of these. None of these. I could also use the hatchet too. Morning star. Hmm. The large club. That's gone now. I could do Morning Star. Or this thing. It's a somber though. Halberd's all been upgraded. Okay. I guess we're gonna go with I need to stay using more ashes of war as well. What was I going to upgrade? Um I used the war pick. War pick's kind of cool. Mace causes blood buildup. So does the spiked club. Kick. I always end up using the mace though. Always. And I, you know what? The war pick looks kind of nice. I'm going to go war pick. I could have upgraded that. Right, right, a flail. Interesting. And it quite literally is the flail. And that's all for my souls. Cool. Okay. Cold short spear. I've still got medium load. So I'd have another weapon, say, like a quality long sword. Fired forward in rapid succession. Storm winds. Or the broad sword. No, I'd want something close. Does the spear have a kick? No. Go heavy broadsword. With the kick. Something close. And something far. Would I have a stamina shield? I could. And I need my talisman as well. And I can have it. This one though. And I have something else. I can. Wow. Uh, I guess the best of both worlds in a long sword. Storm blade, storm caller. What do you do? Just a kick. Surround or shoot? Impaling through. No, we'll go shoot. AoE. We'll go AoE. There we go. Cool. We've got everything that we could possibly hold on to. And uh, an academy to explore with our short spear. Maybe Roger has something to say. I need to go to the turtle and get that second thing. Do you know what I'm going to do first? Say anything? 
I killed somebody well, new. I see you found another great room. Wonderful. You are a worthy fellow tarnished indeed. Make the journey to the capital, Landell, that lies to the east of the Altus Plateau. Oh. At the foot of the earth tree. The two fingers will deny your passage no longer. You may be our best hope. To the east. Find your way to the Elden Ring. For we are tarnished. And we must answer the call of grace. To the east. So these are the shard bearers. The Academy of Rhea Lucaria lies to Lingrave's north. Towering over the mist-laden lands of Lyernia. Renala is queen of the Carian royals. I think he says the same thing for all of these now. Her great room dwells within the egg she so dearly clutches. We have hers. We don't have his. We don't have his. We do have. We don't have Morgoth. It's Margot the Fellowman. Okay. Journey to the capital, Landell, to the east of the Altus Plateau, at the foot of the Earth Tree. The two fingers will deny your passage no longer. You may be our best hope. Find your way to the Elden East. I don't know if I want to go east. He wants me to go there. Where's the Urdus Plateau? Was it the lift? Um, Atlas Plateau, hold on, Sites of Grace. I know I've seen it. Atlas Plateau. I know I've seen it. Somewhere. No. So there, I, I, I guess it could be there. I swear one of these was. Oh, it's Ainsel River. Yeah, I was wrong. And that's all he says now. Journey to the capital, Landell. To the east of the Altus Plateau, at the foot of the Earth Tree. The two fingers will you may be our. And if, well, where would the Earth Tree be? He wants me to go there. Or even here. So through, up through there in that way. Mm -hmm. That's the way. He doesn't say Kaled. He's not saying go to Kaled because Kaled is tough. Kaled is tough. Um, yeah. Kaled is tough. Okay. Nobody else has anything cool to say? What about the Finger Maidens themselves? Now that I have her... Rune... Roger? Always good to see son. No. Okay. No, you don't. And he's gone as well. Cool thing to say. They can bar my passage no longer. Okay. But my, look at you. Only once before have I seen two great rooms together. Look there. The fingers shudder with exuberance. Fine work, brave tarnished. The greater will is pleased. You reckon? You have earned the right to become Elden Lord. Seek the Erd Tree and an audience with Queen Marika to become Elden Lord and restore the Golden Order. The Fingers expect as much from you as they do, young Gideon. Take this, a token of farewell. Oh, great. I have another Talisman pouch. That's really helpful. Um, 
somehow I feel like that's gonna backfire and doing these things is not a good idea there's my farewell Uh, equipment of champions? Queen Marika is the vessel of the Elden Ring. Her <sighs> all its vision, a god in truth. This is near. After the Elden Ring shattering, she was imprisoned in the Erd Tree. A grim punishment for shattering the Order. Despite her godhood, Marika's trespass demanded a heavy sentence. But even in shackles, she remains a god and the vision's vessel. Confer great rules to become Elden Lord. I'm gonna marry her? Queen Marika as her consort. The fingers have willed it so. You want me to marry Queen Marika? Uh-huh. So, there are your two, right? There are your two. Are they got the sword or the shield? Remembrance of Renala, queen of the full moon, hewn into the earth tree. We did read this. Nice icon. And I can either get the Carrion Regal Scepter. It's almost like a sword. Magic Scepter of Renala, Queen of the Full Moon. The Glintstone is known as a Carrion Blue. Carrion? Blue? Enhancing Full Moon Sorceries. Only those of the highest intelligence may wield this. Wow, I do not have 60 intelligence. The finest of all Glintstone saves. Unique skill spinning weapon. Channel magic into the Glintstone to suspend the Scepter in mid-air and cause it to spin violently. Those that, those that touches will suffer successive magic attacks. Sorcery symbolic of the Karian Queen, Renala's Fern Moon, or it looks like a spirit bomb. Uses the cast as a vessel to reincarnate or to incarnate a full moon, then sends it floating toward foes. The full moon dispels all sorcery that touches it and temporarily reduces temporarily reduces magic negation for those it strikes. Interesting. Maybe it isn't a damaging one. It just says incarnate a full moon and launch it at foes. 70 intelligence. Queen Renal encountered this enchanting moon when she was young, and later it would bewitch the academy. It's true. Now go forth. Let the words of the fingers guide you. They didn't really tell me much. They uh, more spoke to you, and you interpreted it for me. Yeah. What's receive equipment of champions? Oh, I can buy her boss set now. So you sell the boss items. A tall crown depicting the moon, worn by Renala, queen of the full moon, increases intelligence when Renala, head of both the Academy of Ray Lucaria and the Karian royal family, lost her husband Radagon, her heart went along with him. And then those of the Academy realized that Renala was no champion after all. Robe indicating the highest order of sorcerer. It's pretty important. Worn by Renala. Same deal. Bracelets indicating the highest order of sorcerer. And this is the moon. Leggings. I see. So that's the first set we can buy. Is hers. And the power from Remembrance. Which I'm not going to use just yet. I will. Bye. We'll do the side pot. Sp spot, side pot. Side spot for the academy. Check that out. Uh, I don't have any souls. Who did I want to talk to Gideon before we go? Blade? Hello there. You don't have anything? What can I do for you? No. No. The Gideon is here. They can't deny me. You don't say anything ever, do you? No. Journey to the capital. Yeah. Yeah. So that's my main goal, journeying to the capital. First thing I'm actually going to do is go all the way here. Going here to the study hall. That's what we're going to actually do. We're going to the study hall. Pa pa 
hard for me. Bear with me. I'm gonna grab a glass of water. One sec. Right, that's what you get for having it ready. Well, I guess I have my two-handing build. It's a kick to break your poise and then strike you. The lance? What's this? Oh, I can't use it. This? Huh? A kick. That's parry. So I, even if I two-hand... Oh, if I two-hand, I can use it. But if I don't, I can't. Let's see. Well, let's keep cautious. Seek Sorcerer. Oh, examine pedestal. Now I can examine the pedestal. I couldn't... Wait, I could. Something fits on this pedestal. You don't say anything new. Oh, celestial globe, transmit to posterity, wisdom of the moon and stars, and obscure forever the transgression of the princess. Princess Renala, or is she queen? Princess Rainy and Queen Renala. Uh, I guess I still need damage negation, but I could also have another talisman. Yes, I have three pouches. I'm going to guess you get five maximum. This is a really handy one too. My maximum stamina can increase. My weight won't matter. Probably magic negation. Because they're going to hit me with magic. I believe they are. Considering where we are. In the carrion study hall that leads to a tower. Okay. Let's go. We're still dying here. Is this just straight to a boss? There's an elevator. Maybe it's a very short walk. Rushing in. Is there anything under the elevator? No Dark Souls 3 double elevator? Well, I guess not. But the elevator's close. Alright. It's a broadsword. I haven't used boards in a very long time. Does this have better? Uh, 49 guard boost. This has 48 guard boost. Wow. Okay. Any secrets from rolling off the elevator? There's one. <laughs> There's one right there. Right there. And I missed it. No fall damage. Okay, roll off the elevator. And you know what? See it there too. It's nicely lit. Oh. Know something incredible ahead. Where am I? Oh. Once I fall, that's it, huh? Interesting. Is that it? That's a fucking hand. That's a hand. That's disgusting. There are two hands right here. Oh my, that's disgusting. Can I get it with my spear? Oh my god. That's a hand. That's awful. Really? Huh. Well, wouldn't you know? I wouldn't have guessed that. I wouldn't have guessed that. But there you go. Um... 
So, what's the point of that? What is the point of that? If it just has hands, is it to kill them before they come out? Never mind. What's the point of that hat? Hat. What's the point of those hands? What's the point of that door? I didn't see any blood stains. Did I not jump far enough? Do people just not bother? I would like my runes. God damn it. I, I rolled as well. I rolled as well. I tried to. Didn't do it. Okay, two spear shots. What about like this? Just two, okay. Not the one anymore. So bad. Oh, there are stains now. Great. That's probably just mine. Is that quite literally mine? No, it's somebody else's. Hey, look, they, they totally trick you. Because the water is there. Does that mean running jump? No? The hell? Is that a running jump? I think he tr no, he tried. Kill box. Okay. Kill box. There's one too. So I wonder what the point of that door is. Maybe it's just a spot for later. Maybe there's a ladder that goes up there that loops back around. Maybe. Not so comfortable with a plus seven, plus six weaponry, but okay. Disgusting hands. Hands is what we're dealing with now. Ah, uh, what we're dealing with now. My poison? For what? Something up above? Ill-omened creature. Well, that's great. A grafted scion. Tell me it's not a grafted scion. I hate fighting those. Oh, see, that's the hole down there, isn't it? Welcome, Loco. You just watched me roll off an edge. That I thought would be a shortcut. It wasn't. Item ahead? Okay. Wow. Something's above me. It's a good idea. How many sorcerers? A few? Maybe. Are we going broadsword? We might have to. Cut them down to size. Fire ahead is true. Oh, I'm dealing with phantoms. I see. You have I have spears. Not so bad. Nope. Familiars. Are you gonna shoot me from above? You might. I don't have poison. I have scarlet rot. I think I have to do some dodging. Oh wow, never mind. Oh. I see. I'm gonna go with maybe a glintstone magic negating staff here. Yeah, the glintstone one, just the regular one. Six and ten.
Magic fortification. Wait a minute. Oh, I only need that for that. An AOE, I don't... But I need it for the... Stuff, but I don't. I need it for the chime. Charm. This. There we go. Charging in. Stop. Oh, you're an NPC fighter. I see. Poison would be really good against. Wow, you. Where'd you go? Oh, I see what you are. You're a constant boss. Yep. That's what you are. You're a constant boss. So once I do enough damage to you, you disappear. That's what I need. Come back. She's gone. She's up there now. Okay. I see. A little mini boss kind of thing going on here. I get it. Oh. Is that all that's in this academy? Her and her item? Yeah, she's got something up there. Maybe she'll keep going. He is working. He's working hard. I don't keep holding this, but I don't need it. I'll drink one. And go. Ham. On her. And put my turtle shield on. There. Magic fortification's gone. Use it now, though. There, she's coming. Hang in with that. Let's go. Full NPC fight. Get away. If I can get her to just disappear, I can take these guys out. Missing them all. Yep, now she's gone. So this is a Crystal Sage fight. That's what that is. Crystal Sage fight in the academy. That's kind of cool. That's kind of cool. She's probably through here. Still. Up. Okay. So it, it, this is the fight. Follow her all the way up here. Carrying glintstone stuff. Sure. Yeah, working from home can be pretty nice that way. Be pretty nice that way. But maybe this is just a mini boss NPC encounter. I ran past all this, so I don't know what I'm missing. But it is the Crystal Sage NPC fight. From DS1 and from DS3. He chased it up all the way to the academy. Might be a mini boss fight. If she has a second phase, she becomes a boss. Maybe. Fight her all across the area. Alright. Let's check the right side and then we're going through. Yeah, that's what we didn't do. It's a study table, I suppose. There's the item. Item to the left. Right, sorry. Ah! Oh, very good message. Almost lost it. Almost lost it. Disgusting hands. Dead. Ugh. Gross. That really is gross. Those hands. They really are gross. I really don't like them. Spider-like. Yeah, that's your animation. They grab me. Fall down on top of me. Go and do it. As soon as I grab the item. Excuse me? Go and fall. All right, you don't want to have a hand. They are gross. They are gross. They are gross. 
What a great message though. Up was 100% right. Okay. No more hands. What a great message. Oh, there is one there. If I hit you, you'll die, won't you? So I'll leave you for later because there's probably an item there and I get rushed and you fall on top of me, don't you? Are there two of you? No, just one. Uh-huh. You won't crawl to me, will you? No, you fall straight down. Okay. Be that way. Be that way. No secrets, no chests, just one way around. Doing this with a plus six broadsword, not great, but okay. Good heal. I have one more flask. Heal. One more blue flask, that is. Turn it down for myself just a bit. Almost full health. Let's go. Thanks for charging in. She's gonna be the. I'm almost out. Actually, I am out. Magic. Apart from Bestial Sling, not worth it. I'll need to put some in mind. I will. For more FP. For more weapon art potential. That's probably a stat I should stick stuff into. Mind. I think it was in was it intelligence? Did weapon arts come from intelligence? DS3? It wasn't a separate stat for that, was it? Paired with intelligence, I think. Could be wrong. Right, she's gonna be through this hallway. Elevator actually, right? Secret? No. The night? Of course. How about hands falling from the ceiling on top of me? I guess not. No. Illusory walls, okay. How about underneath areas? No. How about areas on top? Maybe. Maybe. Seven flasks still. And I can use this amulet for the moment just to get my HP back, even if it's a little bit as we take a look around for shortcuts and drop off points on this elevator. Looking. I don't see any. Nope, it's a straight shot up. All right. She is right there waiting for me to walk in. Uh huh. Is she gonna take the fight all the way around? Maybe. Almost full. Full. Well, since we know she's magic, it'd be stupid not to fight with it. The armor that blocks magic. Probably the best. Yep. Yep. 12, 13, but it's heavy. Carrying night stuff. Foolish. I'll do a lower weapon, but... Magic I need. I'm, he I'm heavy, though. To this. Okay. I'll block just in case. I've got stamina regen from this speed so I'll take that and in quick succession swing faster how much is the broadsword it's six just like the long sword all right maybe the long sword's better because she's further away she'll be rolling we can try and catch her rolling let's take a look I know you're right there. Up. Oh, hands. 
Gonna drop hands on top of me. From the rafters. Go and do it. Show me. That's rats. No? Hands up there. Oh. Okay. Okay. No hands. Just her cronies. Do I feel like... Oh, she's coming to me now. Okay, let's go get her then. This is the last phase that I think. Don't think there's going to be any more. Good block. AOE? Oh. Where are you? Where the hell are you? Stop. Wow. You're kidding me. It's actually a ranged fight. It's actually a ranged fight. She's going to keep coming to me until... She's going to keep disappearing until I fight her. Ranged. That's really interesting. <laughs> no way. As I catch her. Nope. Gotta be ranged. Like knives? I mean, I, I might have arrows. I don't know about sorceries. Oh, she's there. I have... Oh, I could do the um, lightning spear. Is she going to come any closer to me? What if I run her all the way around? Is she still? Come back? I mean, still disappear? Yeah, she will. Still. Wow. All right. You want a ranged fight? I have lightning spear. That's about it. I don't know if that's any good. Fuck. That's not too. Oh, that did something. It's quite literally gonna have to be a ranged fight. <laughs> Unbelievable. Disappear. Right? Fuck. Wow. That hit me for a fair bit, huh? And again. That's a little bit. Go ahead, do it. You'll fire right into this balustrade. One more. That's gonna hit. Damn it. Oh, I'm out. Not good. Fuck me. Holy shit. Heal. Arrows? <laughs> like, actually? I have a little cuckoo magic I can chuck at her. Uh oh. Yeah. Relax. That might hurt. Where's that little magic? These. I don't know. I have FP for them. Stop. Don't. I, I might. Go. Hit it. I'm out. Hit it. Gotcha, bitch. Magic downpour. Cool, so she's like a interesting multi-teed fight. And we have up. Up. Two flasks, hands, water, and up. What else? Rats. Spear time. Pardon me. Interesting.
Oh, that looks fake. There was light coming from there. It's a big area. Huge. Chase her around. I think that glintstone hit her, didn't it? And now it's time for the ladder with the rats. My favorite climbing sections in FromSoft game. The rat. People on those people are up on those chandeliers. I've got 10k though. Alright, precious item. Precious item it is. Somebody gonna spawn up there to try fight me? There are rats. Yeah, look. Before I even got up. Before I even got up. I'm gonna have to do that. At least it's nice and large. Not skinny. Clearly walkable. Clearly walkable. There are more platforms. Oh, I was gonna say, what the fuck is that? Why is that? <laughs> okay. Oh, hi. Oh, you do that. That's why. Hole doesn't seem to, to hurt you too bad, does it, huh? Okay. No critical on that, just a guard break. Fair enough. There is a way up. There are also rats patrolling there. I see. Secrets? This is not the time to fall. Although, I see the chandelier, that's probably the way down. Also that water area there. What else you got? Message? Too high up? Yeah, I wonder how. Because at the moment it's a dead end. I can't go any further. Oh no, there's a ladder, never mind. Foolishness. Hands? No? Do these rats fall down? Probably not. They're patrolling up there, aren't they? Yes. Alright. That one last rat, or is it corpse? Might be a corpse. I don't see any items in that side. Or that side. Perfect place for illusory walls. Items. Corpses. Ladder. Alright. Nothing on the chandeliers. Not that I can see. Not that I can see. Oh! Uh, why? Why did that happen? How? I want to know how that happened. How did that happen? How did that rat come to me like that? From the top, huh? It jumped. I reckon that rat goddamn jumped. And scared the hell out of me. Maybe those are your saving graces just in case you do fall. Get caught by chandelier. There's the ladder. My rats are nearby. Right, well, that's why the bodies are upside down because you can climb further. I don't want to get pincered here either. I see a rat. Got no blue flasks. And it's coming to meet me. So I'm going to wait for it to meet me. Uh huh. Not quite an Alondo Rafters, huh? Why can't I critical you? I wonder if those fall if I break them. There's no more, is there? Did you jump and, and try and make it? No, you got hit by the rats. Knocked off? Dead? Poison rats, maybe. Potentially poison rats. Even better. I thought they caused bleed. That has to come down. That has to come down. Somehow. Somehow that has to come down. 
be coming towards me. Imagine if it tried to jump all the way across there and, and it got me. Go ahead. See, look. I can't do a visceral on it. Which is weird to me. Right? Turn 11k. We had a hundred and something and almost lost it thanks to my stupidity and hubris on a horse. What's going to fall on top of me once I pick this item up? A cerulean seed talisman. Now what does that do? Extra flasks. Where is it? Boosts restoration. Cerulean colored talisman panned after an Erdtree seal. The Erdtree was once perfect and eternal, and thus was it believed that Erdtree seeds could not exist. Now, I don't have enough mind for that. It's a problem. So, how the hell do I get that thing to come down? Because that is something. Going all the way up and all the way across. Maybe for later. No spoilers, no spoilers, no spoilers, no, no, no spoilers. I'm just thinking aloud. I'm just thinking aloud. I'm just thinking aloud, because there's a whole bottom area down there. Just thinking aloud, local. Don't get any ideas. I know, I know. At least I could recognize that it could be something. At least there's that. No bow ahead. I doubt there are illusory walls here. I bet you it's something to do with the bottom level. Why would they give me that shortcut? However, that shortcut is death. Unless it's a running jump that's missed. I've explored this. Confusion, that is true. Wait a minute, lie no bow ahead? As in to shoot it with a bow? No, don't shoot it with a bow. There's probably a contraption down on the very bottom. Well, n no, un unless this fits perfectly through the rafters, which I doubt it does. They're all hanging so that they're all fine. I was gonna say, did that rat not die? First off, church. Then necessary item. Okay, so I've got to go to a church. Some kind of church. And then a necessary item. I don't think I can do this yet. I've got to go to some kind of church. Some kind of church. Smoldering church? Maybe. I would have gotten everything from the churches. It's probably a church I haven't gone to yet. Church, then necessary item. At least I know there's a way up there. Alright. I believe we're done here. It's about to... Now jump off. Okay. Now, that is true. Just always be wary of rats. That does come down. So church and then a necessary item for later, I guess. That's kind of cool. I like that this is blocked off for now. That even though it is accessible to an extent, it's blocked off for now. I like that. And we can just go straight down. Maybe the fastest way would be with the... um. with the chandeliers if I were feeling potentially dangerous I mean there are no messages on them apart from that one am I feeling particularly dangerous kind of or would I fall straight through I feel like I wouldn't fall straight through right 
it might knock me off the side. I mean, it's just, it's a foolish idea. It's a foolish idea. I'll jump off this, but it would be a foolish idea. And we have the door right here. So, got to come back. And the way I'm going to mark that, I can't. I don't have a key. I have to come back. Seek church, then necessary item. All right. Been around for any sacred drop-offs. No. Okay. And there's that area with the hands on the wall that I see from the very first spot, which is probably a shortcut that I can't access just yet. Probably. Let's go back to our regular junkie set. A regular old junkie set. And we'll use the sun tapered shield. Okay. Well, no FP and two flasks. I'll take that for an NPC fight. With 11,000. Yep, it's more shards. Or it's more upgrades. Level twos. Okay, gotta come back. You look local. This, if you're still there. I see that hand. I see those hands, but that's death. Until later. A man tried to do it. I tried to do it. And I died. And I think he's doing a sprint run too, yeah. Yeah. Are there two blood stains? No, just one. Welcome, Alan. Yeah, I'm still alive. It's only been three hours. Yeah. So that column might have to go up or meet something. Yeah, I'm still alive. Three hours is pretty usual for these days. Welcome back. So we have the academy to still do. Sure. Something to put on here. And that makes it. I get it. Thank you, local. And uh, Alan for that very visual imagery. <laughs> Very visual imagery. Something fits on this pedestal, brings up that thing. What do you say now that I have that as context? I'm glad to say I haven't. O oh, celestial globe transmits posterity, the wisdom of the moon and the stars. Some kind of chalice. Some kind of chalice. I don't know about enemy required ahead, but the enemy is ahead. And we're done. With that area we could go that way and really we should because it's a dead end it's pretty much a dead end these are just planes that'll lead to here but this is pretty much a dead end a bunch of tombstones uh-huh uh-huh I uh, wonder what else I can do that's small. Didn't you have that earlier? Are you still having that? Is that why? We could do this. There's still stuff there that's unbeaten. And then all of the... All of this, because we haven't gone past this. Holy smokes. Holy smokes. Right? Is that going to show me the bottom or the top? No, just the one time. Unlucky. Unlucky. Got 10,000. Oh. But I've done this area. It's with the demon birds and the eagles and whatnot. So wait a minute. The clo Actually, the closest... Never mind get out it's fine it's right here hope I'm on the right side though should be or I'm on the ground level 
Oh, I am. Let's see, I don't want the ground level. I wanted the top level. Which might just be the end. This isn't quite a church. Again? I thought we were at 178 from before. You didn't give me your Dectus medallion. I don't know what the hell you're talking about. You didn't give me a Dectus medallion, lady. Uh. How the hell? Yeah, we were at 22. Yeah, we were at 22. Is it really through here? For real? You have to do this? Otherwise, how the hell? Wait a minute, wait a minute. There are little jumps. Oh, it's just for the body, okay. Um, yeah, we were at 22. I was, I know it was two people. Now we've done this already. That's the exit. So I'm trying to get up here. And the way to do that is through here. I see. Who? Talk to who more? You said what? That is the way up there. Okay. I bought everything for you, didn't I? Surely I did. Oh, no, she doesn't say anything else. Ah, I did talk to her. Everyone can tell how good my ways are. Yeah, I bought that from you. I did talk to her. I tried again. Back again, are we? Not everyone can tell how good my ways are. You've a discerning... I don't know if that quest is bugged for me or what, but... Yeah. So anything actually? Arrows. Eh, got a lot. Okay. I'll go talk to the girl with the wolf, but she doesn't have anything else to say. I don't know why she said that. Because I got a medallion from somewhere else. She didn't give me a medallion. I told the all hearing brute already that I possess no such medallion. I like a chainmail. See? I told it I possess or have you come my other half. Nothing. Right, back to jumping, I guess. Jumping tombstones. I had that um, happen to me before. There was supposed to be a king that I gave a letter to. He just wasn't there. King just wasn't where he was supposed to be. So, good work from Soft. Great work. Finished game. Wait, can I AOE you? Probably a reason. I'd hope so. A little talisman. Yeah, this one's worse. This one's the beginner talisman. Ready? <laughs> That's way too close. Way too close. Very cool. Alright. Tombstone time. Or is this the way down? Not up. I think it could be up. Damn it. I think this could be up. Alright. Steady, steady. Oh no, this is down. It's only down. Where the hell did I get up here? Along somewhere here, probably. There's like a horse boost pad. Right? Yeah. Yeah, there's probably a horse boost pad. Or you can just kind of... Do this and die. 
Although if I go up there, what, oh, I can go there. Stop. Stop. All right. Now. There we go. Almost. Nope. And there's like a boost pad like directly to the right of me. No, nope, never mind. I can't climb that. I can't jump that with a horse. Can I? If I fail, I'm dead. And I'd rather not. Ugh, fuck. Okay. All right. Let's find that boost pad up to the top. Gotta be some. There it is. No duh. No duh. Okay. We've done the uh, jail. So why did it say that I hadn't? But I have enemies here to clear. Oh, cause that's death. Is there a boss? Music change. Darkness. Oh, yeah, I remember you. Little ass uh, toilet men. I remember you. Little ambushes. Oh, okay. Oh, oh, kill me. Not quite nice, huh? Whoa. There we go. That's the encounter done. What did I put here? Up on these cliffs. What was I so concerned about? Giant? Oh, fuck. I <laughs> scared the shit out of me. I've been here. That's weird. Oh my god, there are more. There we go. Two heavies. Um, yeah, why did I put that over there? Enemy to farm? Huh. I've done you. That's not good. That's not good at all. That's a kick. How about this? Nope. Harry. Fuck me. Alright, that's better. That's better. That's better. No, I've definitely done these dudes. Maybe I put it for farming? Oh, there was something a boss or a cliff that I wanted to scale and couldn't for some reason. Yeah. Yeah. I, I think. Is there all all this stuff is empty here, right? Really? I guess I'm one-handing. Alright. Oh, you're there too. Can I parry? I should, right? Partial on that. And into a wall. Not cool! Not cool! Too close to wall. 
Go ahead. Ah, oh, too early. Fire. Damage negation. It's broken. All right, have this then. You're so goddamn fiery. Counts as a strike, right? Yeah. You know what I've done, you guys? And find chests and corpses looted. Yep. Okay. So what the hell was I talking about over here? Something to do with these trees. And I put that there. Uh, right. With all the dead ends that I found, there's one place I'll give you access to so just keep exploring. Okay, thanks. I will keep doing that. This guy's going to be annoying. So, there you go. Give me a great dragonfly head. Never mind. I wonder why I put a marker here, though. Where did I put it? I put it there. I had done that camp. Maybe I forgot to take it off. But yeah, I'd been here. But yeah, look, it's right here. For some particular reason. I guess I forgot to take it off or something. Because, yeah, it's just... Flame butterflies, really. But no, it's all empty. And I remember this area too, because of that big ledge. I do remember that big ledge. I mean, the materials of five, five flame butterflies, right? All right. I guess we're taking this off. We're taking this off. My horse getting paled on this? Probably not. Huh. What was I putting here? I just have gone to get rid of it. I know there's one jump that looks totally jumpable that I can't do. It looks totally jumpable, but you just can't get it. And I think it kills you straight away. So it feels like it's got to be accessed some other way. All oh, right. Dudes are here. Okay. Yeah, I remember you guys. I do remember you guys. Alright, go ahead and hit me. I'm an easy target. You know, I, I, I care too much. I listen too much. I might talk too much, but I, I feel too much. What do you say? <laughs> really? Like, down below? Because this guy's got the same idea that I have, and I'm going to turn around as well, aren't I? I bet I am. I remember this. Did I climb up that? You can, but there's no point. Dead end? True. Look at all these messages. We did have a planes trains moment. <laughs> I'm glad somebody caught that. <laughs> we did. I rewatched it recently because, um, you know, that friend of mine who's in Canada, he, he totally reminded me of, what is it, Del Wilkes? When I first watched it with my other friend, we were just like, holy shit, this is just like him. And it really is. So I rewatched it, and uh, it, it didn't didn't grab me as, 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 as hilarious anymore. It was still alright. I like Steve Martin, that's why. But it didn't grab me as, as terribly hilarious anymore, which is a shame. Because I was like, oh, I'm, 
I'm watching all these movies. You know what really doesn't hold up? Dumb and Dumber. I don't know if I ever thought much of that movie, but rewatching it, it really doesn't hold up. Yeah, I might, I guess. See, I watched it younger. You know, I watched it maybe like seven years ago, eight years ago, six. And that's when I was like, that's hilarious. It's so him. But Dumb and Dumber was just not. I didn't think Dumb and Dumber was funny. It barely felt like a movie. It felt more like a set of sketches stuck together. I was like, that's that's the transition? That's it's it's over already? The scene is done. God. Standards in 1994. <laughs> Pulp fiction. Jurassic Park. Dumb and Dumber. Illustrious company. They were in and among. Illustrious company. They hunt for these bones. It always kind of felt that way. I don't know if I ever watched it in full as a kid. I was too young. It's too early for me. But yeah, I was like, no, I'll, I'll check it out. See what else is up. And, uh, no thanks. I don't ever have to rewatch that movie ever again. I wonder if, if there's something about Mary holds up. Because I like Ben Stiller. I like Ben Stiller a lot more than I like Jim Carrey. Um, but yeah, it, it just felt like a bunch of sketches. Just a bunch of sketches. You're an adult already, so yeah. Didn't miss much. Did not miss much, but this is all new. So. Uh. <laughs> Jesus. Unless we drop down from some of these ledges, which is probably that way. Yeah. It's probably that way. Yeah, okay. Pardon me. Um, there's this whole plateau to do. And then go around and do this side. My god. Which I really don't feel like doing. I don't feel like exploring that entire left side of the map. Well, that has another enemy in it, but I've gotten the bonfire. The side of grace. Let's take a look at the side of grace. What have we got? Is that a... I was going to say, is that a hand? Well, I'm seeing a hands now everywhere. Every which way. Okay. Erudition, guide thee. And I believe this is the tower with the uh, climbing around the... Yeah, well, there are lots. Climbing around the walls. Yeah. Yes, there are. And I think that was a boss there too. That I might have killed. Don't remember. So you know what I'm going to do? Uh, I think I'm going to leave it there. I think I'm going to leave it there. I'm going to take two and a half, three and a half hours. Yeah. If anything, we might just explore, I guess, this top ridge. Maybe that ridge. I mean, I've been there. Maybe I've already done this to see this. <sighs> but yeah. And I need to ease myself back into, um, I have done the jumping. Thank you. Message. Ease myself into this. If anything, uh, I'll go buy some consumable mats. And then, um, head back to my life. 2.30. Have something to eat. Had a shake. Just like Alan. That's not quite good enough right now. Do you have anything more to say? Mysterious lady. All right, bye. Yeah, I, uh, you know, just one um, cup of protein for me. I'm happy with that. That's that's fine by me. And my um, Elden Ring playthrough. I don't have a bell bearing, but this is if he died and I didn't buy his stuff, get it from there. So I didn't have a lot of these. No. But I don't want 34. I'll take... Four more. Uh, can't go up by five. You go up by ten. All right. End. 
But I probably have more weapons than. Never mind. Three. Three. Cool. And 56 souls. They're not that expensive, to be honest. 200. 400. They're pretty cheap. I think Titanite is more expensive. I don't have any usable. I do have usable runes. Cool. Yeah, alright. I guess I'll use those. Nothing but runes and upgrade mats. Nothing but runes and upgrade mats. Oh, but I need... I need runes to actually upgrade my weaponry too. There's that. You'll tell me to go to Lanedale, capital of the east. Past Atlas Plateau. And, uh... Blacksmith is this way. Yep. What do you got? Correct. Dead. Um. I guess I could do the smithing for my terrible gear. Bring it up to speed. Or check at other things that I don't have. Um, but I think it's all pretty alright. Everything that I wanted had been play all the war pick. Start of the war pick. Yep. Cool. How many souls do I have? 1400, so I still have enough for the large club. And that's enough. 364. Nothing else can get. Oh, I could have upgraded that if I had more, but I don't. But I don't. So, in that case. Uh, why don't we go big heavy mace? Club's gonna be pure strength. Don't know what this is gonna be. Herb Club's interesting. We've got no more runes. All right, we'll go Mace. Morning Star, sorry, my favorite. The Morning Star, and that leaves me with 24 souls. I guess we could do some PVP to finish up like usual. To see what the servers are like, if they're still up. Maybe they're down today. Um, no, I'm gonna have lunch, 3.30, I'm good. Three hours and 30 minutes. I am good. Almost uh, 330 hours. Cool. That'll be me. And my, my, my monitor just had to check itself out. That was weird. Okay. Um, thanks very much for sticking around and watching. I know it's a little bit shorter, but I'm going to go eat something and relax. <laughs> And uh, ease myself into more and more 12 hour streams. Well, I should say less and less 12 hour streams. And we've got to go to work in about seven days, exactly seven days, first day back. Boy, can't I wait. Fingers crossed. Uh, thanks for sticking around, everybody, for chatting as well. Uh, Fex, are you starting something up? Am I going to send these folks your way? Or are we looking somewhere else? You're going to have someone to eat too. Oh, lasers streaming. Send them lasers way and watch lasers stream as I eat. No, none for you tonight. Fair enough. I'm going to send you lasers way. Say hi to laser. who's playing brutal orchestra. He's doing a Dark Souls run as well. And um, he's doing Dark Souls too. Local. Local is going to start up some streaming. I mean, we did a little bit local. But that's, I reckon I'm tapped for today. We did a little bit. I've got a, it's a really big map and I'm still trying to figure out the best way to actually explore it. I, I don't know. I had a system and you run out of markers. So yeah, week was killed. Some stuff was upgraded. We started the little academy with the drop down area. Checked some parts out. There's a lot to explore and what to see. Thank you for being here for it and for chatting. It really means a lot to have people here as soon as I boot up the game to, to be here watching and helping and you know not spoiling and advising and talking amongst themselves too 
hypothetical situations or not. Say hi to Laser for me. Um, as I send you his way, I don't really have a raid message, so a hi is nice enough. I'll be watching what he's up to as I make some lunch too. So I'll see you around. Most likely tomorrow for a little bit more Elden Ring.